This little compact camera is the Olympus Trip MD3. Which very nicely comes with a box. This camera was released in 1998. Uh, very simple, compact point and shoot. This particular model has been donated to the Florence Nightingale Hospice Charity. They've asked me to have a little look at it to see if it's okay, which is about what, what I'm about to do. I will put a link in the comments for the uh, hospice's eBay selling shop where you can have a look at whatever they're selling at the time. It may even be this. If you've been paying attention, you might realize that I did a video some time ago about the Olympus XB3, which looks very similar to this. I was really dismissive about the camera because I didn't really see the point of it. This one, however, even though it's even more simple than the XB3, I do kind of get it. Right, so to switch the camera on, I simply open the lens up. If I press the shutter release halfway, you may be able to see there's an LED light there. The autofocus is working. And if I depress it fully, because I'm indoors, the flash gun goes off and you can hear the film advancing to the next frame. Well, there is actually a film in here, but the frame counter is here. If I want to uh, rewind film mid-roll, I've got this button here. And really that's it. If I open it up, you'll see there's quite primitive DX coding in here. If I take a roll of film, and this one's a bit, I've wound it out a bit too far. Let's wind it back. Right, so I've dropped this back in here. At least in theory. Thank you. The DX coding reads that this is a 200 ISO film. All I need to do is drag this across to the other side of the camera. And we're good to go. And that is as simple as it can possibly get. So if you're not interested in photography, but it actually looks reasonably smart, uh, it is autofocus, unlike the Olympus Trip 35. Uh, it is auto wind, unlike the Olympus Trip 35. And it's got a halfway decent lens on it. And it, of course it has the flash gun, unlike the Olympus Trip 35. Then, well, why not? Why not give it a go? Um, no great value, uh, but it will work and it will produce some half decent pictures. And if you are lucky enough to get one with a box, which is nice, and a strap, and the strap is still done up, which is nicer, uh, and a case. Well, I don't think this has been used, to be honest. I think this is like, you know, as new condition. There you go, Olympus Trip MD3.